What's up, everybody? Jason here with jazbeescasebreaks.com. Just filled up another uh, 2019-20 Panini Prism Blaster basketball 20-box uh, case break. Uh, number nine this time. Two random teams each. Again, this is a 20-box blaster case. Uh, 15 total spots. Two random teams per spot. And again, remember, no veteran card ship. No veteran base common ship. And here you go, guys. Chase some Zion, guys. Dice roll, list of customer names. Jared, down to Louie. And Hawks down to the Wizards. There you go. Six and a one, seven times. Good luck. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Troy down to Sean. Seven times. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Memphis Grizzlies at the top, down to the Raptors. So, Troy, you got the Grizzlies. Joshua with the Warriors. Lou, you got the Lakers. Matt with the 76ers. Matthew uh, with the Nuggets and T Wolves. David H., you got the Jazz. Louie, Last One Mojo. Mavericks. Fred with the Hawks. Matthew with the Magic. Troy with the Rockets. Fred with the King, uh, Kings. Matt with the Spurs. Joshua with the Nets. Fred with the Cavaliers. David H. with the Knicks. Uh, then you got Gabe with the Celtics. Bill with the Heat. Fred with the Bulls. Bill with the Clippers. Jonathan with the Hornets. Sean with the Thunder. Uh, Jonathan with the Suns, Matt you have the Pelicans, Jared with the Bucks, Matt with the Blazers, Gabe with the Pistons, Jared with the Wizards, Matthew with the Pacers, and Sean with the Raptors. Alright guys, so if anybody wants to make any trades... Your time to trade. All right, Blake just took the Cubs. Christopher with the Atlanta Braves. Jesse just got three. Donner signature spots. I got the Celtics in one, two, three of Optic. Who has the Grizzlies? Okay. Troy does. Zach from 
confirm, confirm blockout and Matt, and then we'll do that trade. So Blazers, two team for one trade, right? OKC in Toronto for the Blazers. So as you can hear me and see in the chat if you're watching live. Um, Matt just traded his Blazers to Sean for the Thunder and the Toronto Raptors. So Sean, you know how the Blazers, there's a little trade mojo. And Matt, you know how the Thunder and the Raptors. That's cool. Troy's getting lucky tonight, Randy says. Alright guys, sorry, I was just looking for a shoe box. Gotta make some. Alright guys. Oh, you feel a jog coming, that's why you're gonna be lucky. These cases have been earlier today. I feel like Jaws and Zions have been coming both. Not one or the other. Let's see how this case goes. First case we pulled a Zion base and a silver. Second case we pulled an insert and two base. A couple of Jaws as well. And I think the first one was a Jaw green as well. Although in this last case we did pull a green pulser.
after this, nothing is technically sold out. But flawless baseball is really, really close, guys. We actually just have four left. Just Orioles, Dodgers, Yankees, Cardinals. Do not worry about the Yankees. I'm sure we can put those in a random number block quickly and sell it. But if anybody else wants to buy other teams, because the more teams available, the more expensive it may be. If somebody wants to grab like the Orioles, the Dodgers, or the Cardinals. Oh, Jordan Bow. There's a jaw. So there you go, on the board. Yeah, my home's chasing that too. Yeah, that's down to like nine. There's everybody in the break. And Jalen Hands. Tash Hall Relic. RJ Bear rookie. Cancer, nice. LeBron Green. Going to Louis with the Lakers last spot mojo. There you go. Very, very nice.
Giants or Miles Turner. Then you got Darius Basley Green. That's a trade mojo going to Matt now. Got five all. Next one. Alonzo Trayer. Rudy Gobert. Uh, Cameron Johnson. Kobe Enter. And we'll move on. Draymond Green, LeBron inserts, Kobe White, Ricky Rubio Relic, Luka Doncic, Silver. Even these can help pretty well too. more about them, okay?
Kobe insert. Marvin Bagley. Justin James Silver. Lamarcus Aldridge, Spurs. Alright, next one. Malik Monk. Tremont Waters, silver rookie for the Celtics. Whoa, someone's stuck. Andrew Wiggins, still T Wolves edition. Ty Jerome, Ben Boya, Aaron Gordon, for the Magic, Jalen Hands, Oh wow, we have an autograph. Oh no, no, what the hell? Why is it flipped over? It scared me a little bit. Fernando. That's true, 2017 is will be yeah, much more than just Mahomes, but of course Super Bowl champion, everybody wants Mahomes.
Never mind, Sean. He still pops in every once in a while. He was in he was in Seattle with you, wasn't he? Oh, did he really? Nice. Found a nice Giannis rookie. Tell you, a lot of people back in the day with Prism rookie cards, people didn't even ship them. You know, they were just considered base. Those Prism like 13, 14 boxes now are like thousands of dollars. When you could have bought them like for like under a hundred dollars. Remember those days? Oh, no, right. He always tells me he was complaining about buying it for sixty dollars. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> sixty bucks. He could have got him probably. <coughs> but no, it's true. That's the reason why those prism cards actually go so high. Because people that rip back in the day, you know, even though this wasn't ten, even ten years ago, this was what, like seven years ago, like. People just threw away the base cards. They, they, they were worth nothing. You know, prism base rookies and stuff like that. Silvers were even like worth anything. People just thought of them as a. I don't even call these prism. I used to think they were called prism prisms before people started naming them silvers. But yeah, like they weren't worth anything. So now that's the reason why those Giannis's go for so much because there aren't really many around. Because people were just kind of just throwing them away. Um, we don't have another one on the site, but we may. I don't know when, though. We've already done three today. Um, we kind of just got to stock it. You know how it is, right? <laughs> this was sold out, like, in, like, ten minutes, so. Bruno Fernando Silver. Yeah, that's the reason why this prism is so high, though, because this prism isn't, isn't supposed to be this expensive. But just the supply and demand, right? Everybody wants it. You have to raise the prices because you paid really high. Of course, man. Like I say, man, I love seeing your IG stories with him. <laughs> so funny. Good kid, good kid. And man, he's already a better skateboarder than I ever will be. I can't even, I can't even be on the skateboard. I like fall right away. Corolla blade, though. <laughs> I can't skateboard. Oh, it's all good, man. No worries. <laughs> it's like a personal within a business account, so it's all good. I know, doesn't it? Yeah. Chris Paul. Nikhil Alexander Walker. Wayne Bacon, nice year little. Oh yeah, that's right. I've seen that scooter. That's awesome, man. That's awesome, man. So what time is it over there right now? It's, it's so if it's six over here, was it at two over there right now? This is four hours behind, right? Or is it three? Also oh, three. Also oh, three hours. Oh, it's three fifty-six. Oh, two hours. Oh, it's three when the time changes. Gotcha. That's right. Chris Paul. 
Yeah, hell yeah. It's going to be awesome. Shea Gilgis. Good, good player for OKC right here. But, um, yeah, I'm pretty, pretty excited about that. I always wanted to go. And it's like, the flight's not even that long, right? What is it, like, three hours, maybe? Andre Jordan. Oh, oh, another green pulser. There you go. In this case as well, 11 out of 25. Kelly Aubrey Jr. Yeah, 2021. It's uh, my uh, wife's sister, younger sister. She's graduating from nursing school, so. We usually, we usually go on a family trip every every year in July, so um, that's where she wants to go. So we're like, hell yeah, <laughs> let's go. <laughs> and the cool thing is that like we just, I just pretty much have to pay for like the flight here. My wife's parents have like a hotel type shirt, so they have like resorts already. That they can just reserve up into 12 months, so we're just kind of waiting for May to happen. May or June, so we can reserve it. Oh, so it's five and a half hours. Oh, I, thought, I thought it was, I thought it was like a three, four hour flight, but five hours ain't bad. That's all good, Daniel. I'm actually glad that you're chatting. <laughs> Not many people chat when I'm breaking like breaks like this. Yeah, I'll probably be like on the touristy side, probably, right? It's like a World Mark Resort or something. That's true. There's always, like, there isn't one island on there that's never that touristy, right? There's, like, a, only locals, really, but... Yeah, that's true. I figure Maui would like it. would be the most touristy one, right? But in June, the weather, they were saying it's like around the 80s, right? Mid 80s. Does this sound really good? Is it is it like humid around that time in June? How's the weather like in June? Since you're always there. Here's another Zion. There you go, two Zions for you, Matt. Gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, yeah, definitely. I mean, the only beach cities I've ever been to, like the ones in Mexico, and obviously here being in Hermosa, but resort wise, you know. I love Mexico beaches. Cabo Pool. Went to Zihuacanejo last year. So I'm like, Hawaii was always one of them I always wanted to go to. Got a, got a whole year and a half to lose some LBSs. <laughs> With 80s all winter? Really? <laughs> That's winter over there? That's crazy. Dude, I was driving back from Arizona today, and it's so crazy because, like, living in California is just, just a trip, man. 
I was driving right there off the 10 next to like Morongo Casino and like the mountains just next, like not even far from the freeway, it was just all snow. <laughs> and like when we're driving, this is normal, sunny. <laughs> I mean, it, I guess it rained yesterday there, so it produced some snow, but it's, it's crazy. <laughs> You got the beach, like, from where I live, you got the beach, like, 20 miles away. Um, with the mountains, like, 20 miles, like, 10 miles away from where I live, actually. Pete, Pete, oh, Pete, Pete Alonso was rookies last year. Yeah, he last year, yeah. Yeah. 2019? Uh, yeah. Yeah, he's in 19. So, Coleman Draft, maybe, uh... Oh, wow. <laughs> so, it's, like, just as big as LA. Well, yeah. I mean, it's not just as big as L.A., but it's like, that's how crazy small it is, right? When L.A. is almost just as big as it. Jared Culver. James Harden. Let's do that flawless. Let's do it. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, right? So it's not like this, like, this is the city of L.A. where it's just jam-packed. Hawaii, that's pretty nice. A little trade mojo there. Matt. <coughs> Keldon Johnson. Justin, what's going on, man? Just got my super break stuff. So much more than I expected and saw. Yeah, I know. It's such a long, long break video. I think a lot of people are just like, I'm just going to get surprised when I get my box or my package in. PJ Washington Jr. Well... Like, okay, like Mariota and those guys, I think he's from Honolulu. That's 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 where they have the Pro Bowl at, right? When they usually have it in Hawaii. RJ Barrett. Another RJ Barrett emergent. Michael K. Giltress. Bogdanovic. There's a jaw. Yeah, I think everybody's going to start getting the Super Bowl mixer stuff today and tomorrow. Oh, nice, Black. Oh, that's awesome, man. That mix it was so fun, guys. Chuma, Okiki. That mix it was so fun. It was just so loaded. Glad we did that Super Bowl mix and we filled it up the night before. That was even better. Some Barnes. Oh yeah, you're a Patriots fan, so what's up? Is TB really gonna leave the Patriots? I think it's like 75%. Like I'm not even saying like guarantee or any of that. 75% for me because I feel like he might. <laughs> he definitely has options. All right, we got a Jaw, Penny Sleeve, our top of that Zion, Aubrey, Jaw, Jaw, LeBron, Jaw, and another Zion. There you go, guys. Appreciate it. This was break number nine. If we do put up another one, it'll be number ten, guys.